Hey guys, so today I'm going to be recreating this like smoky green, lime green look. It's a little much, I know, but it's just kind of fun, just having fun, being creative. Okay, so the first thing we're going to start off with is a color called nylon. I'm using all matte colors, by the way. Nylon, which is just kind of a shimmery color. And I'm going to take a dense, well first I'm going to take a blending brush, a really fluffy brush. Put it on my brow bone. Put it in the inner corner. But actually I'm going to need a denser brush for the inner corner. There we go. Dang it, this has green on it. Okay, here we go. I'm using my 219 brush to pack it on heavier in the inner corner. And getting it into the inner crease as well. Okay, now I'm going to take a mixture of, well, I guess I'll just put on Jux first. Jux and Water Nymph. Water Nymph came out with the Lar Collection. So I'm pretty sure you can't get it anymore. Water Nymph looks like that. The center one, they're kind of stuck together, so. Water Nymph and Jux. See how Water Nymph has a little bit more blue to it, but I mix them together just because I feel like it. Okay, come on. All right, there we go. But I put on Jux first. I put it just in the center of the lid. And I really pack it on well. And then I put Water Nymph over it. Okay, and then what I take is A mixture between Sour Lemon, which is a pro color, and Wondergrass. Sour Lemon looks a lot like better, but I think it's a little bit brighter, I think, but it's pro and it's matte. And take Wondergrass, which is from Sea Shock, which came out forever ago. And I'm just going to kind of take those. And as you can see, I, I on the other eye, I have a little, you can tell that sour lemons in there because it gives it that lime, limey look. Okay, and I just kind of put it right in there and it's super bright. Right about in there. And then I take my blending brush and I put some water nymph and juxt on it because I want, I don't want the sour lemon and wondergrass to be too overpowering, but I need to put a little bit more on now because I'm blended. And we're going to do a lot of blending later so it doesn't have to be perfect. Now I'm going to take Humid by itself, you don't have to mix anything with it. Sorry about all the mixtures, I just don't have every color that MAC offers, so I kind of have to mix. So I'm going to take Wondergrass on my 219. Uh, and I'm going to put it on the brow bone and in my crease. See how I'm kind of putting it a little bit above the crease as well? And you gotta be really good at blending to make this look natural. Okay, and then I kind of just do circular motions in the outer corner and do like windshield wiper motions 
here. And I also take some Jackson Water Nymphs together, kind of blend it out with that as well. The other eye's looking a little bit better, so I'm trying to see. I'm going to add some more Jackson Water Nymph to the center. And I'm going to blend out humid some more. All right. The colors are very washed out, so they look much brighter in person, so be careful. And now I'm going to take an eyeliner, line my eye, and it's from Jane, I believe. No prestige. And it's a, um, what is it called? Soft Blend Coal Eyeliner and Leaf. And now I'm going to take the little sponge applicator, put a little bit of humid on the tip, blend out the outer corner first, then go in to smoke out that line since this is a smoky green look. Now put a little bit underneath. Blend it. And then take your pencil brush, put some humid on it. Well actually it will go lighter first. Put some of the juxt and water nymph mix. And then take humid, put that in the outer part, and blend in. And now I'm going to use Lash Blast. The other eye looks a little bit better, so... Here on my bottom, lashes, I like to remove some excess on the tip of the root. We don't go all the way down, my bottom lashes are really long. Okay, and I think we're going to do a cheek as well. Let me see how much time I have. Okay, I have like less than a minute, so let's see if we can do this. Okay, for cheek, really quick, I'm going to put on I have no blushes over here. Okay. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to use my cheek tint that I did in my Vampy Lips video with the same brush. Yeah. And then I kind of like to blend it out. Okay, and then for lips, I'm going to use Viva Glam Special Edition. You can really see the day. Okay. I want a nice and neutral lip. And there you go. Thanks, guys.